Okay, today I want to try and hook up this hot spark ignition system and eliminate your points and condenser. So I'm going to try it on the ditch witch here today. First thing I got to do is it said check the voltage here to the coil. It's like 12.48, so that should be fine. It said no more than 14. I'll have to check it when it's charging too. <clears throat> now it said the coil has to have at least three ohms resistance. Oops. Three point six. I know they filed the points lately to get started, but it wouldn't start again the other day. And I put one of these on our Ford tractor, and boy, I really like that conversion kit. I have to take the points out, that plate, put this new plate on, hook up a couple wires, and we'll see. Okay, we have this in here. It's a nice little setup. This magnetic sleeve went on real nice. Nice and tight. And it says zip tie the wires if you can in there. So I, I use this off the ignition point. This little angled piece and uh, had a hole through there. So I hooked a zip tie up to it. Not too tight, but it should keep the wires out of the way. Should be good now. This should go on, hopefully. Oh, that might be off a little bit. Oh, dang, well, yeah, it might be. Shoot, that might be hitting it. Oh, that went in there good. I just didn't have it lined up. There, now I just have to hook these wires up. They're gonna be long enough. Yeah, I may try and turn that coil just a little bit. Okay, I just got the wires hooked up today. It's a little tight. I have to either extend that red wire or get that turned. I couldn't get it turned that easily. So that's another day in these wires. I'll have to get a new set of wires too. But, here's the fun part. Let's see what happens. Let's see if she starts up. All right, go ahead and roll it over. Man, nothing. Oh no. Maybe the coil's bad. Oh, let's see, I'm... Where am I getting that? Yeah. Yeah, that switch is bad. Tyler thought it was bad, it was acting up. Yeah, I gotta get a new switch. Okay, we have a new switch on there. We're gonna try take two, see if she'll start. Oh, Ooh, that tells me it's gonna go, the timing's off. Let me move it a little bit one way or the other. Let me try that again. Listen to this. Whoa! I know that timing's off. I'm gonna move it. Okay. Let me try this. I move the distributor.
Well, no timing light for now. I know I'll get ripped on, but boy, I'd say it sounds pretty good. You could hear me moving it back and forth. All right, one last time. That system is uh, hotspark.com, I believe. And it said if you got it uh, tuned right, she'll purr like a kitten. And I think they're right. Sounds good. I just got to tidy up the wires and maybe get some new spark plug wires. And I see one more thing I don't like here. That looks like something from a mouse. Oh boy. So we're going to have to, we're going to have to check that out. But anyway, we're going to try and plow some snow with it, see if it starts, and maybe we'll get in the snow plowing business. Forget about the uh, trenching. Let's see if she starts. Oh, that clutch sticks yet. Yeah. 